Hey everyone, welcome back. So today I am going to open some boxes. <laughs> um, but first I am going to just put on my makeup and just show you what I do. Maybe just a little video. Okay, first I have to remove these purple earrings. I was wearing these, these little pearl purple earrings. Well, they are not real pearl. But I was wearing them in honor of um, domestic violence um, awareness, domestic violence awareness. And I also have some pink ones for breast cancer awareness that I um, I inter wear them interchangeable. So interchangeably, that's the word. Anyway, so first I'm going to be using my Pat McGrath I don't know what palette is this. It's not on here. Let me see if it's not, if it's on here. It is the I have no idea. <laughs> you guys, I don't know how to tell the word. Which one? Oh, is the mothership six, which is i don't know what so i'll have to look up for the name and show you so it has a big old mirror and here are the colors very pretty so i'm just gonna do a simple little look i will tell you that i don't really like blending out a lot like to stay there and blend and blend and blend and blend and blend no i just apply Whatever I want to apply, I could go lightly or just apply the shades and then blend them out. Um, I don't know, something about my camera is off because, let's see, okay, I think it's good. Okay, so first I'm going to go in with this color right here. I don't have the thing and she doesn't write the shades, colors on on her eyeshadow palette so I hope I'm in frame because I am not good at putting makeup on camera guys this is how I do like when I'm in a hurry and I need to bring my mirror closer this might be a little longer than usual but anyways And if I talk while I'm putting on this makeup, it it goes even slower and longer. By the way, I've already um, put on foundation and now all the rest of my face makeup. So that's what I'm putting on for today. And I have very hooded eyes, so that's why I try and put it above so that when I um, look straight ahead with a relaxed eye, you could at least see the colors, see the eyeshadow. Okay. Now to darken it up a little bit at, in the corner. It's not darken, you know. I'm not saying the correct words, but you know what I mean. To... I don't know what the word is. I'm gonna use this dark color right here. It's not, uh, it's kind of a black, but not a dark, dark black. I'm taking a small brush and I'm just gonna put it right here. Maybe to intensify, that's the word, I think. I don't know. And for whatever reason, my eyes are always kind of patchy. Sometimes when I apply makeup, uh, I find that it looks so intense and then when I um when I am editing, I am like, oh my gosh, I should have put some more someplace. Alright. I think the 
that but I'm not con I'm not focusing on the edge right here in the middle because I'm going to put on a another shade right there so Then I'm going to put on some glitter glue, mix glitter glue, it's just a simple look, simple, simple. I'm going to use this shimmery color right here. And let's just swatch that for you. Ooh, that is so intense. Very, 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 very pretty. And before the glue settles on my eye, let's, let's apply this color right here. I feel like my finger puts the color all over. It's not like it's my finger doing it without myself, but I kind of feel like I put it where it does not belong. what I'm going to do is I'm going to take back my little brush again not my little brush this one the first brush and dip it into the dark color and kind of blend out this a little bit same for the other side I think I made a boo-boo, but as long as they look like cousins. <laughs> See, I don't like working with shimmer as well, though I used the, the glitter glue. Next, I'm going to use this color right in the center here. It goes like that. Let's see. Maybe not. Yes. Um, swatch. It's it's very creamy and not too shimmery, but I hope it'll do the job that I want it to do. I'm gonna put it in my water. Um, what do you call that again? Tear it up. Tear it up. <laughs> Okay, and I'm gonna put it also on my um, brow bone using the same brush. I think I always get this wrong. Then for below the eyes, I'm gonna use the what can we use i'm going to use the purple purple looking shade this shade right here let's give you a swatch i think it's a dual chrome um or blitz color that i cannot explain so I'm gonna try and put it below. Hope it works. Okay, I think that's good. 
and I think that's the look you know guys that's the look I find like in the corner here it's a little patchy right here so I'm gonna try and just okay and uh, did I bring call a switch I'm just gonna do a little blending on the edge I I I don't really go for transition color whatever color I have I work with it I just blend out the edge so it doesn't look too harsh okay so hope you like the look and what I do next is I have this little um what you call it eyelash curler which is so difficult to use I don't know I feel like I'm grabbing half of my eyes <laughs> when I use it I don't know how to, to really use it without I don't know but I'm gonna use that if you know a really good one please let me know I bought this at uh, was that store Um, not TJ Maxx, uh, Burlington. Burlington. Then I go in with two mascaras, the Thrive Cosmetics and the Maybelline Sky High. I think that's what it's called. I, have, I don't have my glasses and I don't want to put them on. Okay, so one of the things that I did that I do not, I never do, well, except if I make a mistake or if I forget. Um, is that I put on the mascara before I use setting spray. So, I have here with me this e.l.f. Glow Dewy Mist. I love it. So, I'm going to use it. Oh! This is so good. Now, I usually have a fan, which I don't. So, and then... Let me just, I'm going to use, I don't really know what, how to match lipsticks with looks. <laughs> so, I'm just going to swatch these two for you. I got them from Sephora. And I, some of you might be saying, oh, you should have used this one or that one. This is this one. And this is that one. I really don't know which one to use. I'm gonna use this one because it's closer to what I have on my lip. Let's see. Ooh. This is kind of bright. Hmm. I don't know if it looks good, but it's on there. And it's on there to stay. I brought with me a lip liner that I forgot to put on. So that's me for you. Okay. Okay, sir. So that's the look. Guys, I'm about to open some boxes. So thanks for watching. Please feel free to, to subscribe to my channel. Leave me a comment. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video. And I'll see you next time. Bye.